While you're still looking for weekend plans, one place I can tell you you don't want to be or find yourself, and that's in the ring across from the megastar, L.A. Knight. He's one of dozens taking the spotlight at Heritage Bank tonight, and he joins me now with details about the show. It's a full circle moment here. I actually started wrestling here in Cincinnati. I was going to ask you A while ago. That. Well, you don't have to ask me because I'm going to tell you. You tell me. There's a bunch of people out there waiting for me right now to say, let me talk to you. So I'm there talking to you. There we go. Talk to me. Uh, but yeah, uh, tonight, Heritage Bank, like you said. And look, you all were just talking about the NFL draft, yeah. weren't you? Well, guess what? WWE, we're doing our own draft. Raw and SmackDown are going to pick from the entire pool of superstars to see who's going to go uh, to Raw, who's going to go to SmackDown. And that starts tonight live down at the Heritage Bank Center. Uh, and if you can't be there, make sure you check it out on Fox. But there are still some limited tickets available. Well, yes, so there are tickets available. And I was asking you in the commercial break, do you know who you're going to fight? And you don't. You, you literally will be finding out I don't even know if tonight. I'm going to have a match. I know I'll be there tonight. I know I'll be on the show. I literally don't know in what capacity yet tonight, which is a dangerous spot because anything can happen. Anything can happen. And yeah. that's why we love to watch because anything right. can always happen. Can we go back to your Cincinnati days here? I'd rather when, not. Oh, just a no, little bit. No, yeah, Come on. Because yeah. I know you, you started training here, right? <laughs> yeah, no. I actually, uh, sorry. Show I'm me, break. show me. I used to live right here. Really? No, no, I did not. That's, I, did, that's, I, I that's couldn't insurance. afford any, no. I couldn't afford anything <laughs> like that. I, uh, whatever that. No, I, I used to live uh, up mostly like Springdale, Fairfield okay. kind of area. Yeah, for for years and years. Started wrestling in a small place called uh, Heartland Wrestling Association, yeah. which is now defunct, does not exist, but uh, was a great place to get my foundation. And all these years later, wow. here we are. Pretty cool. And when you were here, you know, yeah. you were kind of just starting out at that time. So I imagine you had to you know, work on the side of training. Did oh, yeah. you have any interesting jobs while you were here in Cincinnati? Uh, I had a, uh, yeah, 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 I sure did. Um, I, mostly I worked in restaurants, uh, but I had a couple odd side jobs. Um, I was security for, let's just say, an entertainer um, of sorts. Okay, that makes sense. Um, yeah, we'll just go with that. Okay. Uh, and, and, and maybe some other goofy jobs here and there that were, you know, kind of out of the ordinary. But other than that, yeah, I worked at a wood mill at one point up the, up the way. Uh, and Bulky Veneer, I'll give you a shout out way up in Hamilton um, and uh, a couple other places. But yeah. it, every every restaurant that is a chain, I probably worked at. You <laughs> probably name it, that was there. That's yeah. cool. And I probably got fired from there, too. <laughs> so. Well, hey, I want to talk about your fans because you yeah. have just amazing fans yeah. and I wanted to show a little bit of a clip of a video with you of one of your fans recently that went viral this is you with uh, a fan who was his birthday and he was at one of the shows and you made his day by sitting with him I think were you on the bus to Wrestlemania for this yeah, no this, so this was uh, Wrestlemania just ended and I was uh, I just returned my rental car I was heading to the airport and uh, I ran into this fan, uh, Derek. And uh, if I'm honest, I had no idea I was being recorded this whole time. So I didn't even know until <laughs> I came up on it, which is totally fine because it was it was a great interaction. But uh, Derek was he's a super fan, apparently. I guess I've come to know that he has a, a large social media following. Um, and yeah, he, he's just like big time excited here. And, and I really appreciate running into people like this. And you're going to see here, he's going to be like, no, come over here come and sit, sit with, with me. me. And I'm like, all right, I'm coming to sit with you, Derek. So it's a cool experience. Really cool, fun guy, and I guess uh, you can go follow the guy on uh, on Instagram. He's got a whole well, big thing going. So. I wanted to show you something too. My, you have like when you watch the show. One of the things I love is seeing all the people hold up there's their signs. So this is my friend's <laughs> son. You are tops to him. Like he loves you. So he made his own yeah shirt. And yeah. Uh, how much do your fans mean to you? I mean, oh here, there well, we go. That's Tyler with his yeah. I, I hate to give the people too much power here because I don't. You know, look, at, at some point. Um, I got to take the credit myself, but no, look, if I'm honest, the people kind of made me over the last year. I, I, in a lot of ways, I shouldn't be in the position that I'm in, uh, and I am because the people spoke. The people kind of yeah. rose up. There was a large groundswell uh, that kind of made me, uh, that kind of got me to the level that I am, and, and it got to a fever pitch over last summer, and it's continued on since then. Uh, and now we roll into 2024 after me building the foundation that I built with the help of all those people. And uh, yeah, so I'm, I'm greatly appreciative to it. Um, I, I don't think I could have done it without him, let's be honest. Uh, but at the same time, yeah, we, we got to continue on. Okay. Well, people can see you tonight. A few tickets left. It's Heritage Bank Center doors, 615, show 715. Get there. The draft is going it's on. It's the draft. It's the draft. And I just got one more thing to say to you, and that is yeah! 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 All right, and we'll be back. Sure, you can stop watching, but let's be honest, you want to know more. Tap the links or even better, click subscribe to stay in the know.